The message you're about to listen to is a message from Apostle Eric Nyamiche, the chairman of the Church of Pentecost. Apostle Eric Nyamiche preaches the gospel in its simplest form to help the believers walk in Christ and also how the believer relate with his world. This year, the message is on unleashing the church to possess nation. Join us and let's learn from Apostle Eric Nyamiche and be a blessing to the world. If you are new to this page, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so that when new videos are uploaded, you can have access to it. Make sure you go to our own page and check out for more videos. Thank you. Let me have all the men in this arena. Welcome. Uh, 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 oh, please come, come. Umra, Umra, Umra. And uh, so you just be around me. Some of you should come in front. Some of you should come in front. Uh, come in front. Uh, yeah. Yo. Prof. Okay. Yo. So you are electricity bill, eh? <laughs> this is school fees. When so school fees. You are chop money. <laughs> <laughs> you see. Bills to manage. We munyina no esa wo hwe etuetu ya. Now all of you come to me. Munyina mumra, mumra miso. They are all coming up on one human. Munyina e ba nipa ba ko eso. You need wisdom to manage them. Munyina nyansa no what to do in So that even though they are still around, you have some liberty to move. Found so munyina twa ho ahia, obetumi adan dan ho kama kama. Soon with wisdom you can even eliminate the the school fees. And che nyan senti ubeti me to your school can you know your children would have been grown and they are not in school going age. Abre now many nyinima ubiya in you so oko school. Then the rent the fee a dye council little by little kakra kakra with wisdom wisdom nyansa this one is gone nyansa, eh, yeah, because I now have so my own home. Sanse miya ma bom is see be come 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 who are you? Papa I did easy catch off money <laughs> <laughs> little by little, you can manage your wife. Your wife is also gainfully employed. And now she doesn't have to come to you for daily chop money. So we eliminate this one. No, no, so who are you? You went. <laughs> Hey, you see, and above all, if, you if you are a father, oh, yeah, what that means is that your your father is also grown. Yeah. So you have a father to bury. And your in-law to bury. And <laughs> what This is life. I don't know I mean, This is life. Wait, and so don't say that, don't you know that I'm their father, I'm their husband? It doesn't mean anything. You need wisdom to manage life. So let's put our hands together for all these, all these problems that were coming on. <laughs> let me say that some people are sick. Not because of malaria and yes it be a war yari ni pedu yamu yari but because of bills and so usha no more with you to your car if you are so much sick it been so because they are not able to manage their children so they want to me and show one muscle you they are becoming harmful for them my friend i pray that god will give us wisdom you buy a mouth on your coupon be more nyansa to be good fathers now what to me to be able to manage our homes well despite the challenges that Come on, us. And found out how I would do a bit by and so we need to take decisions to move on in life. See to me, see, I abbreviate me a queer name, Abraham. Otherwise, you will remain static. And yes, I will be enough for you. Now, you need to pass classes, exams before you get to JHS one. I don't know if it's a school, no, as old to me, a channel so training in answer. What was every day there are decisions for past fathers to take otherwise you remain at the same place and decisions could be simple and some could be very very complex yeah, because challenges come in ways 
some are weightier. And so you need to manage challenges. The need for wisdom becomes very critical when you are a leader. When you are a father. When you are a husband. When you are living and leading an institution. Because the effects of your decision can have a ripple effect on the constituents you are you survey. Uh, we are elevated to be fathers and husbands to solve challenges and tough problems. One day Israel asked for a king. And this is what they said. Say First Samuel chapter eight, verse nineteen and twenty. Yeah, can someone who mano di kai eating mochi in yemu tung krong? First Samuel eight, nineteen and twenty. Ekusi edio no no. But the people refused to listen to Samuel. No, they said, we want a king over us. Na omano am penese uti Samuel na wakana se debi na onhen ara na oni yenso na verse 20 please then we will be like all the other nations with a king to lead us and to go out before us and fight our battles ayen so ye nye se amana me nyina na ye nyinu mu ye aten na on free edi ni ye nim ni oku e ma ye we want someone to lead us e pobi obedi ye nim a king to lead us ni obedi ye nim this king will fight our battles. Now, what are our battles? Battles are conflicts and struggles. Now, battles are what? Conflicts are or struggles. So, they are saying that we want a king or we, in this sense, we want a father over us to deal with our struggles as well as his struggles. The father has his own challenges. But as a father, you also have to help your children to meet their challenges. May the Lord grant us wisdom. We want a king to help us to lead us and help us fight our battles. Now you fight. Your, your family's battles as well as your own battles. Oh, and this push Solomon to go and ask God for wisdom. So Second Corinthians, Second Chronicles chapter one. From verse ten to twelve. Now give me wisdom and knowledge that I may lead this people. For who is able to govern this great people of yours? Now fathers, you constantly be asking for wisdom and knowledge. Now to be able to manage their home. Please, to be able to do that. You need to manage a, a home. Now God said to Solomon, verse 11, now, let's pay attention to God, what God said. Since this is your heart's desire, and you have not asked for wealth, normally, you see pastors and uh, fathers, husbands, always talking about money. But you see, there are certain things that are better than gold. Now, possessions. There are certain people, once they enter into any employment, their first salary, they buy in land. As if possessions is all that they need. You need wisdom to be able to know when to build and when to save. Now, 